Hey everybody, uh, I just wanted to do another van build update. Uh, it's been a while since I posted that first video. Uh, and essentially I got the bus running. I am still parked in front of my parents' house, but tomorrow I have my warranty validation and after that I can actually start driving the bus um, and doing little camping trips and stuff locally. Uh, really e eager to get back on the road, but um, I gotta be careful this time. I've blown up enough engines as it is. So today I actually just got my new fridge in the mail. This is the fridge. Um, so essentially I got a great deal on it. It was off eBay, it was like 550, uh, new in the box, plus free shipping, which is incredible for something this big. So today we're gonna get it installed. Um, kind of do a little walk around on the bus and show you what's new. DC cord, kind of a bummer that it, oh, maybe this comes apart, that's better. Um, that I can, I can add terminals onto uh, for DC, which is what we're gonna do today. I don't want all this really, I'll keep that somewhere. Uh, it's huge, is the first thing I, I'm thinking. The compressor does take up a ton of space, as you can see here. Um, from my hand down is all internals, um, but that's, it's still huge. That's as big or bigger than my Coleman I had. Plus you don't have to put ice in it, right? So that's, it's all usable space. Um, on the side here, we've got a USB port, which I'll probably never use. I have like 12 USB ports in my bus already. And then there's some settings here. There's also a Wi-Fi app. I am going to have to make some tie downs for it. To hold it down to the to the deal but yeah let's get installed <laughs> mount it down right there with just a little bit of room on the side that's gonna be great that looks really good This was a 
an hour of working on the bus and it's already like destroyed the stuff everywhere <laughs> but the fridge works it's pretty simple to install i really should run an inline fuse i'll probably do that soon um but it's working it's trying to drop the the thing to 18 degrees fahrenheit <laughs> i don't know i'm stoked so i'll probably start cleaning now so i just got finished kind of tidying up a little bit um and the fridge is now running uh i don't know what it's set to i think 20 something degrees it's only been running for maybe 10 minutes and you can already feel it's like cool in there totally cool enough to to be functional pretty stoked i love it second warranty validation um, the first one I didn't pass because my car pretty messed up I bought them used and um, it was kind of a gamble like if they were going to be uh, in good enough shape um, they're really good carbs they're Delordo 40s but uh, mine were just used and we were just gonna risk it and see and, and they turned out to need a rebuild. Uh, completely rebuilt them and I, they're not tuned yet. I'm just driving, they're pre-adjusted so I'm driving to get them tuned right now. And if everything looks good then uh, then I can actually drive this thing as my vehicle. Um, super eager to get on the road and start driving this thing around. I don't even care if I get a job locally and I'm just, you know, camped out like working that's what i want to do right now is just have this be part of whatever it is i'm doing so and hey i'm a free man i have passed my warranty validation and i'm allowed to drive my pw bus and oh god is it feel good I'm gonna go.